Hello everybody. Welcome to the live. I'm just gonna wait a few more minutes for more people to join. How's everybody doing? Hello. Hi, everybody. I'm doing very good. Thank you for asking. Waiting for Black Friday? Me too. <laughs> So um, before I get started in uh, unboxing this beautiful collection by Fiote, uh, my name is Tim. I am one of Zillabu's muse and today I'm going to be here unboxing this beautiful winter collection for you and maybe show you guys how to do some designs if you guys are interested. But for the most part, we are going to be unboxing this collection. If you guys have any questions, please feel free to comment and ask, and I will do my best to answer whatever I can, okay? <laughs> um, we'll just give it a few more minutes, maybe like two more minutes, and we will start unboxing this beautiful collection, okay? Love plat nails. Yes, it's the season. <laughs> it's finally fall. You know, I'm currently in New Jersey, and it's really cold here. So you can actually achieve this design right here using this collection, okay? So everything I use in this design and also in this one are in here, okay? And if we have time, I will um, I will do maybe one or two designs from here, okay? Okay, we're gonna give you like one more minute and then we will start, okay? So in this live, I'm gonna show you when what you would get when you buy when you buy um, the collection. So you get this box and it has a lot of goodies in here. So I will show you what you get in a whole collection. Okay? Do you have a store location in Jersey or is it just online? It is currently just online. You can go to zillabu.com. Okay, so I guess we can get started. So this is Zillabu's. Um, Zillabu carries this brand called Fiote. They are com they are our contemporary nail brand, and this is their uh, winter twenty twenty one collections called Nuance. So when you buy the collection, you would receive it like this: a box. Okay, it's a beautiful box. You can see it has a marble pattern on top, all around it, and even has the colors on the side as well see over there yeah and over here you can see what you would receive let me know if I'm not in frame okay um, and you will you see what you can receive so there's like postcards there's like a swatch board there is like a bunch of stuff in here okay so now we're gonna open it up so when you open it the first thing you will see is this little package that contains all the nail goodies. So we're gonna dig into this one first, okay? So let's put this aside. Now, in here, I'm gonna open this up. I'm gonna take it out. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna throw this away. So the first thing you will receive is this little display card. So it's really cute. It's only one-sided, okay? 
it's one sided and it's like a beautiful marble pattern and it has like a little tag so you can actually like hang it up if you want to or just put it on a desk beautiful and for this you can actually create some displays you can put them here like so right you can display them like that or even if you make swatches you can put your swatches on here as well right so this is a very beautiful way to display your work right it, it matches the collection okay so you would have that and the next thing you would have are these postcards so these are three beautiful postcards that are included in the collection it's a winter collection you can see different skies different colors very beautiful warm fall type okay and it's a postcard so you can either you know write letters to your friends send it for a christmas card or even just frame them because these are very beautiful you can even actually put them on the desk and you know do your nail picture if you want to you can use this backdrop backdrop as well right so these are all very versatile things you can get from the collection box okay the next thing you would get are these two marble boards so these are two different marbles you can actually put them on a table take nice photos you can it's actually double-sided so you have different options of different colors you can use and you know you can use them for backdrops for displaying if you want to these are all very beautiful okay so these are all the goodies that will come in your collection box okay so the next thing you will get is this weird looking thing and you might be wondering what this is and I will show you in a minute okay so now let's bring the box back Ooh. okay so in the box you will receive this display stand so this thing is very sturdy okay so what you can use with this you can put it on the table like at your desk at your salon you can actually put your tips right here so you can actually display your colors like so I'm just showing you really quick okay so you can display all your beautiful colors I'm just giving you a sneak peek right now <laughs> as to what the colors are but this is what you can do with them right you can just display your colors put them on your desk at your salon on your desk and your clients can choose from the colors that you have okay and these are all very beautiful winter fall colors very warm very cozy colors so this display you can use them as well and of, of course the names are all written here as well so you can use them to your advantage okay so now let's go back to the box so in this box you want to take out everything in here I'm gonna try my best not to ruin this yeah, hold on. Do you guys have any questions so far? So I'm gonna take out this box. So you can take out you can take out the whole thing like this. Okay. And there's a base at the bottom as well. Like this little base right here. You can take it out as well and you can dispose of this. Okay? So what you can do, I'm gonna put back these colors in here. So for this box, at the bottom of the box, this little thing, you can actually put this back in here. And this thing that you got inside is actually for here. So if you put it right back here, ta-da, you have a very beautiful display. Isn't it so cool? So everything comes in the collection box so when you buy the collection box you can actually do so many and so much with it and it's a beautiful display right every everything here has like a gold a rose gold frame so it looks very luxurious and very expensive right <laughs> so now that i show you what these boxes come like all these things i'm going to start swatching these colors okay Can you guys uh, see or do you want me to zoom in a little more? Let's try. Hold on. Let me let me readjust. <laughs> I'm zoom in a little bit. Ooh. Is that better?
Is this better for you guys? Cool. So we're gonna get started. The first color in this collection is NU01. It is called Chili Red. Okay, so this red is a beautiful warm red. It's not like a bright neon red. And also these colors are all syrup gels. So meaning they're kind of transparent but they're very pigmented as well. So the formula is actually very well done. It's not streaky. It's beautiful coverage. So I'm going to go ahead and swatch the first coat. And depending on how pigmented you want the coverage to be, you can apply as, many, as much or as little product you want. So for this one, I'm going to show you if I do very, very minimum product. So this is one very, very thin coat. Can you guys see? It's, it has very beautiful coverage and the colors is still very rich, right? And it's not a too bright of a red. It's a very nice, warm, muted red, like a chili. It's perfectly named. So actually for this one, I'm gonna paint a little bit thicker coat, okay? And for these um, Fiote gel formula, you don't have to worry about um, it running away from the sides because it doesn't. So you can actually get right up there at the cuticle, and pull it down. So this is one coat of chili red. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and cure this. All these gels cure for 30 seconds in an LED and 60 seconds in the UV, okay? Yes, it's a very pretty color. So this color is actually very nice and warm. It's not too bright, it's a very beautiful red for winter time. It's not your typical Christmas red, but it's winter red. You know what I mean? It's kind of like candy apple kind of vibes. <laughs> And if you guys have any questions, please let me know. You can get this collection right now at zillabue.com and it only it costs you $178, uh, $179, excuse me. But look at how much goodie you can get, right? Okay, so it's done curing. I'm gonna do a second coat. So the best thing I can think of to describe these colors is rich. It's a very luxe, luscious, rich color. It's not bright, it's not like in your face, but it gives a very nice rich tone. And of course, after two coats, you get beautiful coverage. And you also get like the true color showing, right? Isn't that beautiful? Look at that. Okay. Put this back okay if you guys have any questions please feel free to ask i will try to answer whatever i can okay how's everybody doing obsessed me too <laughs> i love this collection it's such a beautiful color look at them the colors are so gorgeous what is this one my bad i used it <laughs> Okay, so that's done curing, and uh, I'm gonna, for all these um, colors, I'm gonna apply a shiny top coat, and I will show you what it looks like matte as well, okay? Right now, I'm just using the um, Fiote Addiction top coat. Super, super shiny. This is the top gel. Okay. So for the next color, we're gonna dig in here. 
it's NU02 it is called maple camel so this color is actually a combination of mustard yellow and like a warm orange so it's like a very nice marriage between those two colors so I'm going to show you what they look like again you can take off as much product as you want because this is a syrup gel and you can actually use that to your advantage as well to do different designs okay so this is a nice warm rich yellow taupe color so it's almost on the verge of like kind of like a mustard but not yellow enough it's a little bit more brown a little bit more orange Oh, there's something over here. Hey. So this is NU02 Maple Camel. This is only one coat. Okay, you see how beautiful the color. It's not too yellow, it's not brown either. You know, it's like a nice hybrid. Okay, so we're gonna cure this for 30 seconds. And now let me come back to the first color. So NU01, this is chili red, the first color that we swatched. So this is the color in glossy. And let me show you, eh, the fingerprints on it. So this is the glossy, and you have it in matte. You see how pretty that is? Here, yeah, see? I'm totally out of frame, am I? Yep, I'm out of frame. There you go. So even in matte, it still looks very beautiful. Doing a matte taco gives it a softer look just because it is a jelly color, right? So it makes it very soft. Absolutely gorgeous color. Okay. And another cool thing about this display as well, you can actually put them right here. Ta -da! Look how pretty that is. <laughs> okay, so here is um, Maple Camel. I'm gonna do a second coat. Okay, so there's two coats. Nice, rich color. Okay, I'm gonna cure this for 30 seconds. To those who are just joining in, hello. Thank you for joining my swatch party. How's everybody doing? So for the maple camel, this is what it will look like when it's matte. Ta-da! Look how pretty. That is one of my favorite. Same. It's a very beautiful mustard yellow color, but not really yellow either. It's like a mustard brown almost. Right? Look how beautiful that is. This is the matte finish. Okay? Actually, I'm just going to put them right here. Oh no. Boom. See? I'm going to put them right there. So you get one shiny, one matte. Okay? <laughs> Butterscotch! Thank you! That's the word I'm looking for. Thank you very much. <laughs> so again, I'm going to top coat this one with a shiny gloss top coat. Perfect description. Butterscotch. You're correct. Here you go. This is the shiny. Mm -hmm. Beautiful color. Now, next color in this collection is NU03. This is called Dewy Olive. And it is exactly the color you think of of an olive. 
they named these colors really well. Okay, so again, I'm going to show you. Yeah. Okay. See, it's a nice mix between a brown with a hint of green. Okay, so I'm going to do one very thin coat. And I will say in this collection, um, this specific color, the formula of this is a bit more, uh, I don't want to use this word, but <laughs> it's a bit more moist. It's a bit more wet feeling. It's very smooth. It almost feels like wet. <laughs> but this is... This is the um, Dewy Olive in one coat. You can see how pretty it is. It's like a brown with a hint of green. So it's not too in your face chocolate brown, but it's a nice warm brown. Okay. I'm gonna cure this for 30 seconds in the light. Would you guys be interested in me showing you guys some designs later using this collection? I have two. So here is the second color. Oh, my fingerprint. Oh, it's my fingerprint. Hold on a second. So this is Maple Camel. This is the second color in the collection. Okay, I'm gonna put that right here. Okay, now that that's done, let's do a second coat of Dewy Olive. So again with these colors, depending on how opaque and how pigmented you want the color to be, you can apply a thin coat, one thin coat, or two thin coats. Don't be tempted to put a lot because it's it has a very good coverage on its own, okay? Here we go. This is Dewey Olive. Now, the next color in this collection, NU04. It is called Muted Khaki. So it is kind of like a very dark, deep army green, if you will. Okay, so let me show you the color. Here. <laughs> so this is called Muted Khaki, NU04. It's a very nice, rich green tone. So this is NU04 Muted Khaki. It's a nice deep army green with a hint of brown. It's a beautiful color. Okay, I'm gonna cure this in the light. <laughs> How's everybody doing? So let's do a second coat of Muted Khaki NU04. So again, this collection is available right now at zillabue.com. It is on it is currently selling for $179.
Okay. So this is two coats of the muted khaki, a beautiful deep green color. Okay. Put it in the light. This is a very beautiful collection. Yes, this green is very, very rich. It almost feels expensive. <laughs> okay. So the next color I'm going to swatch is called NU05 Noble Navy. So it is a very, very deep, dark blue. Very dark blue. Okay, let me get the tip. Ah, there's no tip on there. There you go. Okay, this is NU05 Noble Navy. It's a very beautiful blue color. Look at that. Oh, it's almost like the night sky. So this color is blue with a hint, like the slightest hint of purple, not a lot, a very slight hint of purple, but definitely more leaning towards like the gray black area. Okay. So this is one coat of Noble Navy. Very beautiful dark green. Yes, the pigment is mwah, c'est bon. <laughs> you know, I wish like the camera can pick up how beautiful this color is. This looks almost black on live, but I promise you it's not. It's a very deep dark blue, okay? I wish dry, I wish gel can dry faster. <laughs> We're halfway through. We're five colors in. There's only three more colors and two specialty gel that you will get in this collection as well, which I will show you at the end. Okay. So here we're gonna do a second coat of Noble Navy. Yeah, what I love about this collection is honestly the pigmentation of this. But it's really cool because it's like a jelly, it's a syrup gel. So it's actually like see-through. But because the color is so rich, it gives it such pigmentation without being so like harsh. It's like pigmented, rich in color, but at the same time soft at the same time. You know? Look at that. Beautiful coverage. This is Noble Navy NU05. Now, for the next color, we have NU06. And this color is called Muse Purple. Okay, let's bring another tip. Muse Purple. So, this purple, it's honestly a great color it's <laughs> pun intended <laughs> it's a grape color because it, it the color of it it's like a grape okay here you go this is muse purple boom baby look at that Ooh. and you can you can do a lot of designs with these colors especially for the winter you can use these colors for a plaid you can use this color for a marble you know use it as a solid color it it just works so amazingly well because the formula on this is just mm, so good trying 
get it as even as I can. Again, don't be too, do not be too tempted to put a very thick layer. Less is more. Okay, you don't want your gel to wrinkle up. Make sure you put a nice thin layer. Okay, and always, if you want to be more pigmented, do two, do two coats. Okay, don't be tempted to do thick layers. So this is one coat of Muse Purple. Very nice, deep, great color purple. Like eggplant, actually. Hello, hello to everybody that joined. So beautiful. Yes, they are. Yes, I love the syrup. Yeah, this is a very beautiful formula. The packaging, amazing. Look, look at this. I mean, you can just display this on your table right there. Put it right on your desk and let your client choose from it. <laughs> at your salon, at the register, you know, display them. Put it right there. <laughs> so people know people can come in and see, oh, look how pretty these colors are. And be like, I want that one. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> now, second coat of Muse Purple. This is a nice eggplant color. I got confused with this color and the next color actually. The next color is the green color. This is an eggplant color. My bad. Now this is two beautiful coats of Muse Purple. Absolutely stunning. We have two more colors to go. The next color here, we have Mauve Violetta. I'm not sure if I'm saying that right. Mauve Violetta? Violetta? Violetta. Violetta. I'm going to say Violetta. So this is actually the grape color. So I'll swatch it and I'll show you. So it's like a nice, almost like a plum color. Look at that. Ooh, my goodness gracious me. Oh. Look at that. So this right here is Mauve Violetta. Love this color. Okay, I'm gonna cure this for 30 seconds. So pretty, I know, thank you. I mean, I shouldn't thank you. This is a, this is not my color, but yes, these are very beautiful colors. Absolutely stunning. That's a pretty color for my marbling. Yes, absolutely. If you use this color for like with a white marble, gorgeous. Any color marble, honestly. How many did I swatch already? Uh, seven, actually. <laughs> I'm more than halfway there. I'm so sorry you joined late. But it's okay, I will, towards the end of all my swatches, I will go over the colors one more time so that you can um, see it, okay? And towards the end, I will show you, show you these colors in different finishes as well. because I totally did not already open this a long time ago. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just um, top coding the rest, the other colors before. So I'm trying to save time. Okay, so we're gonna go back to this 
mauve violeta okay so this is the first coat and I'm gonna do a second coat I would consider this one of a, one of a burgundy you know how sometimes people want like a burgundy red but this is more like a burgundy purple because people have different versions of burgundy in their head but this is definitely a burgundy leaning towards like the purple side look at that gorgeous so this is two coats of mauve violetta okay And now we have the last color. Let me put this back. Boom. The last color in this collection is NU08 Maroonficent. This is really hard to pronounce. Maroonficent. <laughs> Looks like red wine. Yes, very good. Red wine. That's a very good description. Although I think this looks more like red wine. <laughs> um, but this is Maroonficent. It's named after Maleficent, if you can guess. Yeah. This looks more like wine to me, but I don't know. <laughs> but I mean, it, it's true that it also looks like a wine color. So you guys are right. <laughs> I also drink more white wine, so I can't really tell. Anyway, this is NU08 Maroon Fissin, okay? Now we're gonna do one coat of this. See, this is more like wine to me, isn't it? I don't know. Here we go. This is one coat of Maroon Fissin. Look at that. Also, if you guys notice on my swatches right now, the formula is a bit thick and that is because it's cold in Jersey. <laughs> so when it's cold, it tends to, your gels tend to thicken up a little bit, okay? But no worries, just work it a little bit and you'll be good. Okay. Here we go. So this is one coat of Maroonficent. It's such a hard word to pronounce, Maroonficent. Here we go. This is one coat. And it's so pretty. So gorgeous. Into the light. How are you guys doing? We're tourists. This is the last color in this collection. And there is two more specialty gels in here at the end. Okay, which I will show you momentarily. Now let's do the second coat of this maroon facet. Beautiful. Ooh. You know, this color in a lipstick would look really pretty for the winter, isn't it? I mean, I don't use makeup, so I have no idea, but I think it'll look very pretty. Look at that. Ooh. Boom, baby. Two coats of maroon facet. Look at that color. Look at that pigmentation. Ooh. Would love to see this map. Yes, I have them all here ready for you guys. I'm just gonna show you guys at the end, okay? Because I don't wanna keep coming like back and forth on the camera. Sorry, let me just pick up the others. And then I'll show you these two specialty gels that we have here. Line them up right here. One, two, three. Five. Hold on, hold on. Six. Seven. Ah. So many tips on my table. <laughs> I 
Okay, now, now that we swatched all the colors, I'm going to show you guys these two specialty colors that we have. Actually, before we do that, let me top coat my room percent and I will show you. Okay. And towards the end of the video, I'm going to show you guys the different finishes you can have. Way too similar. It only looks similar on camera, I promise you, because it's not picking up the pigmentation properly. But I promise when towards the end, I will show it to you maybe closer on camera so you can see the difference in the color. Okay? It just looks similar on here. <laughs> but I promise I promise you it's not. It's very different. Now, the two specialty gels in this collection, one is a clear glitter and one is the it's a texture gel. Uh what's the name of this collection? It's called Nuance by Fiote. So it is called hold on, hold on. Nuance. The 2021 Fiote Winter Collection. Okay? You can get this at zillabude.com. Yes, new ones. Thanks, Lauren. Okay, so in this collection, eh, hold on. We have two specialty gels. So you can see here is glitter and this is texture. Okay, so I'm going to first show you the glitter gel. So this glitter gel is called CL01. It's called Gold Flake. But you can see here on the bottle, it's like completely saturated glitter, but it is not in the bottle. Okay, so in the bottle, it's actually more like this. Can you guys see? Let me know if I'm out of frame, because I cannot really... <laughs> Here you go. Look at that. So this is a clear, flaky, gold, gold flaky gel. Okay? And it is intentionally done so that it's sparse, so that you can put it over any color, and it will add a nice, like, luxurious, expensive touch. Okay? So I'm going to show it to you on, like, a clear tip. Okay, so this is a clear tape. I'm going to do one coat. So you see how it is actually sparse. You see how sparse it is? Okay, it is intentionally done like that. So you can put it over any color, right? So I'm going to cure this. So delicate yes it's a very delicate gold flakes okay so I'm gonna do the second coat you don't really need a second coat but I'm just gonna show you what it looks like and here's a little tip for you guys if you guys want to do like you know with like bigger chunks of gold flakes you can put a second coat of this this um, clear gel this glitter gel and then before you cure it you can just add little bits of gold flake on top like the bigger ones so it gives like a nice blend of effect okay this specific gel is purposely done for it to be more sparse so that you can put it over any color but look how pretty that is and I will show you in a bit how this gel looks over all these colors. Okay, it, it, it makes it so pretty. So I'm gonna cure this. I'm gonna put this color over here. So there's two, four, six, eight colors. It's like a, it's almost like a muted rainbow. It just looks don't look like it on a on camera for some reason. Okay. Now the next um, gel we have in here is a texture gel. Okay, it is called oatmeal sand. So texture gel meaning just it has like glitter in it, in it and it's a little bit more pigmented. Okay, so this is look how pretty that is. Oh. Okay, it looks so like creamy, <laughs> and it has little specks of black glitter in it. On top, like a very very light beige color. Okay, so I'm going to swatch this for you. Yes, so this is... Ooh, it's upside down. So this is called Oatmeal Sand. 
and it's very pigmented. So you can take a small amount, this is a very tiny amount, and you can boom, look how, look at the coverage. So for this one, a little bit goes a long way, especially because you want to see the little black glitters in there coming through. So don't put a thick layer. If you put a thin layer, you see I drag off most of the product, you can see the black glitters more. Does that make sense? The color uh, reminds me of like cookies and cream. <laughs> Maybe I'm hungry, but <laughs> it reminds me of cookies and cream. But look at that. Gorgeous in one coat. Yeah, absolutely beautiful. Amazing coverage. Very rich, very creamy. Okay. I'm going to cure this. And honestly, with the um, with oatmeal sand, you can honestly get away with one coat. You really could, but you know, out of habit, I always just do two coats of every color. That's just me. But now I'm gonna show you the colors. Okay, so these are the colors that we did today. I'm gonna use this backdrop because it's pretty. Let's use a lighter one just because you can see better. Let's use this one. So this is NU01. And you zero two. We have chili red. We have maple camel. We have dewy olive. We have muted khaki. Eh, you're sticking together. Muted khaki. We have noble navy. We have ooh muse purple. We have mauve violetta. And maroon for some. So I'm gonna try to bring it as close to the, to the camera as I can. Here, can you guys see it better? Is this better for me? Sorry, there's like a little bit of delay on here. So do you see? Ah, my goodness, sorry. Do you see these colors? They're definitely not, <laughs> they're not similar in person, I promise you, okay? It just looks really dark on here, okay? So I'm gonna show you guys these colors in the matte. So here we have it in matte. Is the black Tweety Stevie gel still sold out? I believe it is. Yes, so the colors are very true to the bottle, 100%. Whatever color you see on the bottle, that's the color on the gel. Yes. Okay, hold on, let me... Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna try to do this for you guys. Okay, give me one second. I'm gonna try to adjust my camera to go closer so you can you guys can see better. Hold on. Boom. Uh, eh. Sorry, this is my first time unboxing on camera. So forgive me if I can't see anything. Is this better for you guys? Can you guys see the colors better? I'm trying to capture it as best as I can. Can you guys see the colors now? There, it's a little better, right? Oh my god, I wish I can have better lighting. Is this better? <laughs> there we go. Alright, I'm sorry you guys. Is this better? Yeah? 
Sorry guys, this is my first time and I don't have the best lighting in the room. So here you go. These are the colors. Okay, we have chili red, maple camel, dewy olive, muted khaki, noble navy, muse purple, mauve violetta, and maroon vicin. Look at that. Yes, absolutely. You can see it more with the matte. Okay, the shiny is because literally it's reflecting the light, so it's really hard to capture on camera. But it is very true, it's very true to the color of the bottle. Okay, and okay, remember the um, the gold, the gold glitter gel that we have, the gold flakes. So if you put them over these colors, look at them. Okay, I'm gonna show you now. Boom. Look at that. Oof. I should have done this from the beginning. It looks so much better now. Okay. <laughs> so here we go. So this is all the colors in the collection with the gold flake on top. Look at that. Look at that. Look how pretty. So the top row, you have it in shiny, and then you have it in matte, and then one with the gold flake. But look at these beautiful colors. Look at that. That is so gorgeous. Look at this. Ooh, my goodness gracious me. Yeah, this is a truly winter collection. Very beautiful, very rich tones. Very opaque, true to color. Okay. And of course, this is the um, the gold flake in matte, which also will be very pretty. And this is Old Muse Sand in matte as well. Can you show the bottle of the gold again? Yes. Looks like this. It's called Clark glitter. Yeah, but as you can see, like on the label here, it looks like it's like a it looks like a solid gold color, but it's not. Okay, it's more sparse. It looks like this. Okay. This is in matte, and let me find a shiny. It's in here somewhere. This motorcycle. Okay. So this is what the gold gel looks like. See, it's very clear, it's very sparse, and it's perfect to put on any color. Yeah? The old new and matte, yes, I mean, hold on. Look at this. Let me get the bottle. Look at this. This is old mule. Okay, look at it. Oh! Is that on the website? I don't think it's available at the moment for individual bottles. I think right now you can, you can just buy the whole collection. But I mean, if you buy the whole collection, you get so many stuff in here. Okay? Look at that. Look at this old look at this old mule sand in matte. Ooh. Imagine if like um in summer you put this as like the sand color. You add like shells, a little add like golds on it. Beautiful. Okay. And so this comes to the conclusion of the unboxing. Um collection name is called Nuance. It's called Nuance. Right there, nuance. Ta -da. Okay, and the reason why I urge you guys to gold and Christmas can't go wrong. Absolutely, gold and oh my god, this red, chili red right here. I feel like chili red is like the best color in my opinion. Chili red and this khaki green, a muted khaki. Oh my god, amazing. Right? Look at that. Ooh, and then these colors right here for for winter. Oh my lord. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Okay, ah, dropping everything. Okay, so the reason why I would urge you guys to get the collection instead of individual bottles, I mean, you can do whatever you want, of course, but you get, you get, look at this, look at this beautiful display, right? Let me zoom out for a little bit. You get, you get a beautiful display like this. And you can put the colors right here, you can put this on your desk, 
put it on the side, your clients can pick and choose. You just get a lot of stuff in the collection box. Right? Look at that. How beautiful that is. Now, so this is the end of the um, unboxing. Um, if you guys are interested, I'm more than happy to do a couple of these if you want. Are you guys interested or you're done? <laughs> Let me know. So these two designs, I used the colors from this collection. Every color in these two designs are from this collection. Would you guys be interested in me showing you how to do this? Let's see it. Okay. <laughs> so I think I'm going to the top middle, this one. Sure. So I would do, I'm going to do um, the plaid and I'm going to do this one. Okay. Sounds good. I'll take this away. So I'm going to teach you guys how to do the plaid and this middle one right here. Okay. So uh, let me find a tip. <laughs> I'm out of nail tips. So please, please, please get these colors before they go on out of stock because they will. <laughs> it's a very, this is a very beautiful collection. Okay, so I'm going to show you guys how to do the um, the plaid first. Okay, I'm just going to put this right here. Is this, is this good? You want to go closer? Okay, I'm going to show you guys how to do the plaid nail. So the first thing you want to do is get oatmeal sand and apply one thin coat. Okay. Again, this collection is called the Nuance Fiote Winter 2021 Collection. You can get this over at Zillabu dot com and it's currently selling for one hundred and seventy nine dollars and Zillabu has afterpay so get it get it <laughs> okay so this is one coat of oatmeal sand I'm gonna cure that and now you guys are gonna tell me what color you want the plaids to be <laughs> so should I still should I do these colors or do you want to try different colors what do you guys think Love those? Okay, I'm gonna go with it. So after you do this, I trust you. All right, so this is one coat of oatmeal sand. And after you do that, you're gonna grab, so in this color, I have chili red. I have, I forgot the name of this color, maple camel and also mutakaki. So these are the three colors that I use in this plaid. Okay, so let me get a little palette. Boom. Okay, so you're gonna put these color on a palette because you don't need a lot of it. And this is what I meant before when I said um, you can use the F take advantage of the fact that these are syrup colors because they're a little bit more jelly like. Now, there is no particular order on how. Um, on what color to apply first. It, it really doesn't matter. You can use mix and match whatever color you want, okay? So I'm gonna just put these three colors on my palette. Okay. Now I'm gonna use this brush. So this is um, Fiote's um, short oblique brush. It is a angled brush like this. Sorry, like this. Okay. So what I do is I take any color, doesn't matter, but I'm going to start with the chili red. This is NU01 chili red. 
and you can just draw any line. So I, I hold the brush more like this. Sorry, is this in, like this instead of like that? If you want to do a thinner line, apply it like this. If you want a thicker line, do it like this. So right now I'm going to do a thicker line over here. And draw one down. Like that. And I'm I'm applying quite a bit of pressure. Because it helps push you see this two lines that it forms on the side? That's what it does. You have to apply even and consistent pressure. Okay, so this is the thick line. Now on this side I'm gonna do a thin line. So I'm gonna hold it like this towards the nail. Draw one thin line down. Like so. Okay. Apply a bit of pressure so it gives it a hard edge, just like Lauren said. Yes, thank you. Okay. And you're going to cure this. In the light. Okay. So I'm only doing like half a cure, so like 15 seconds. Okay. So I'm gonna take the same red again and I'm gonna do a horizontal line. Okay. Remember, apply even pressure so it gives it a hard edge. Okay? Just like that. Yeah? See how it already starts giving like the plaid kind of lines? Yeah? I'm just gonna fix this up a little bit over here. Boom. Okay, and I'm gonna flash here for 15 seconds. You can do a full cure, but I'm just trying to save time on this live, okay? And honestly, you can apply the lines however, whatever color you want in any variation. I promise you, it will look good, okay? The only thing you have to remember is you have to cure in between the lines, between the horizontal and the vertical. Make sure you cure before you draw the horizontal one, okay? Now. I'm going to use um, Maple Camel, the second color, and I'm going to draw it off to the side a little bit, right here, like so. Boom. You see that? So it like, it's like it mixed the colors in the middle. Because they are jelly colors, they are syrup colors, so it, it blends very easily. Look at that. Boom. Okay. See how that's like a harsh edge? Yeah. So you, you want to apply pressure when you do this so you get a harsh line. Okay. Gonna cure this. Okay. And now I'm gonna do, let's do it up here. So again, I'm going to do line right there. Just like that. Okay, gonna cure this now. And 
And the next step, I'm going to apply the green. Muted Khaki. So for green, I'm going to apply it to this red over here. Let's do it this side. Okay, let's add one in the middle. Why not? Like so. I'm gonna cure this. Let me fix this real quick. flash gear so again these are all colors from the Fiote 2021 winter collection called new ones okay and it's currently available at zillabue.com okay these are all beautiful nice rich winter colors okay and now I'm gonna add the middle line There we go. Okay. I'm going to cure it. How's everybody doing today? Thank you for those who are still here. Those who are just joining. Hello. How do you make that color to be see-through? So this collection, it actually, these are actually syrup colors. So they are actually a little bit see-through. So that's just, I'm just taking advantage of the fact that these are syrup colors, okay? This is the Fiote Winter Collection New Ones. And they are syrup gels, so they actually are a little bit see-through, okay? So you can totally just leave it like this if you want to, but I'm gonna just add the red back because the red I'm gonna want to want it to be a little bit richer. Okay, so you can just reapply the red wherever you had it before. Look at that. No problem, you're welcome. Hello from Argentina. Hi. You can get this color right now on zillabu.com. Okay, you can get the whole collection. Okay, I'm just gonna add the red at the bottom here.
Okay, just like that, you have applied nail. Yeah, we're gonna cure this. How often do you guys restock things that are sold out on your website? Well, I'm sorry, but I don't know the answer to that because I'm only a penis. <laughs> Will, will you ever do live doing your own nails? Uh, yeah, I will, but I'm also, um, this is not, <laughs> I'm, I'm just amused on Zilla View, so right now my job is to just do this. But on my account, I will. <laughs> um, when are the tweet trios coming back and stuff? I'm sorry, but I don't know the answer to that. I'm sorry you guys because like I literally just I'm amused for Zilla View and I don't know anything about the stock and when it's coming back in stock but I do know that they're trying really hard to get things back in stock and remember these are all stuff from like Korea and Japan and you know shipping and custom right now is a little bit tricky so you might just be a little bit patient okay you guys and trust me when it comes back it's gonna be worth it okay I will go hit the notify me button on the website. Absolutely. Yep, do that. So you will get notified once anything is restocked. And it's and it's amazing. Because you need them. <laughs> These are all amazing things. Okay? And so for... Uh, <coughs> Excuse me. Tim's New Studio. Yes, that's my... Right there. <laughs> that's my um, my personal Instagram handle. Okay? Um, so this is the mat. Uh, this is the, um, the plaid. And you can honestly do it shiny or matte. I just prefer it in matte just because it looks better for me personally. So here is the matte top coat. I'm going to apply a layer of the matte top coat. Okay. I'm going to cure this for 30 seconds. Yeah, give or take about a month, you know, because like with shipping and custom, remember this is coming from all the way from Asia, so it's gonna take a while, yeah? So please be patient with Zilla View. <laughs> it looks so good, thank you. Yeah, so once you do a matte taco, it will basically look like this. Yeah, a very nice, very easy plaid nails, yeah? So, ta -da. so this is what it looks like when it's matte. These syrups are game changer for winter plaid. Absolutely. So easy. Like for example, like right now I'm only using three colors. The red, the green, and the yellow. Imagine if you do it with the purple, the red, and like a blue. Oh my gosh. Will that be so pretty? <laughs> yeah. Absolutely, the mat is so pretty with the plaid. I agree. Look how pretty that is. Yeah? So this is the plaid nail. Okay? And the next design I'm going to show you is how I achieve this design in the middle. Okay? And it's actually fairly simple. So I will do that right now. Let me get a tip on. I have like so many tips on the table right now. Okay, so I'm gonna do it in um I'm gonna do it in the chili red instead just because I like the color. But honestly you can do it actually no let's use the um the muse purple. Actually no this is not muse purple, what I'm talking about. This is mauve violetta. I'm gonna use this color. Okay. So you're gonna apply two coats of your favorite color. Any color from the collection. The world is your oyster. Okay. So see see this is what I mean by their syrup colors. They're a bit see-through to begin with. But in two coats you can get pretty much a very rich coverage and it gives it a very nice soft look. Yeah, something in here. Eh, got it off. Okay. I'm gonna cure this for 30 seconds. Yes, if you guys have any questions, please feel free to ask me. I promise I will do my best to answer anything that I know personally. Um, again, I'm just I'm just um, Zillabu's muse 
and I do not know anything about the restock date, um, what is available on the website. So I apologize for that. But if you go to zillabu.com and for every, whatever that's out of stock and you want to know when they're going to be back in stock, just click the notify me button and they got you. Okay. So this one coat, I'm going to do a second coat. Second coat, cure for 30 seconds in an LED lamp. One minute in a UV, okay? So now the next thing you need to do that design is the Clark glitter, which is also in the same collection. This is the gold flake glitter. You're gonna need this and you're also going to need this. So this is um, the Terrazzo Shell Glitter from Bonnie B Nail. This is also available on zillabue.com. Okay, it's basically just a bunch of um, different color like crush shells okay so i'm going to show you guys how to use this along with the gold flake glitter your nails are everything thank you they're empty at the moment <laughs> i don't know what to do <laughs> so i'm just leaving them like that um so now once everything is cured you're going to apply one coat of the clear glitter with the gold flake the gold flake glitter Remember, this glitter is designed specifically for it to be sparse. Okay, so don't be tempted to apply a lot. Don't don't apply it too thick. Okay, let the gel do the work for you. Because you also don't want to cover up the color underneath. You know what I'm saying? So once you have the gold flake gel on top, what you're going to do is you're going to use... You're going to apply some of these shells. And you can apply wherever you want. I'm going to apply it right in the middle. Just like that design right there. And honestly, you can use whatever color shell you want. I'm just going to pick and choose a few. Right there. What is on my tweezer? Right there. You can use any color you like, doesn't matter. Okay, just like that. I'm gonna cure this for 30 seconds. Um, is the gold flake sold separately or in a set? It is in the set. Um, in the future, these bottles will be able, I think, will be able to, they're gonna sell it separately, but at the moment, they're only selling it as a full set, okay? But I mean, look at these colors. Just get the set. Just get it. I am such a bad influence, but just get it. <laughs> just, just get the set. Because <laughs> this is just so pretty. It's so pretty. It's just so pretty. Look at them. It's just so pretty. Oh my god, I'm so obsessed. Ugh. Okay, so once that's fully cured, what you're going to do now is you're going to apply a non-wipe top coat. I'm just going to use whatever I have on hand. Would a 60 second cure be too much? No. So this is just like a no wipe top coat. Okay, apply no wipe top coat. Here. The packaging is amazing. It is, it's just so divine. It looks so expensive. It looks so like luxe, luxurious, glorious, amazing. So the next thing you need is Leaf Gel's non-wipe fixing gel. This is also available 
on Zillaview. What is your Instagram nail page? Oh, it's this thing right here on the palette. <laughs> Tim's Nail Studio. <laughs> Thanks, Lauren. Um, yeah, follow me if you guys want. Uh, I, I post a bunch of cool stuff. So once you, once you have any top coat, what you need is leaf gels, non-wipe fixing gel. So usually this is used to like apply charms and crystals, but there's another way to use them. You can actually apply chrome on these. Okay, so what you're going to do is you're going to use that and you're going to get a detail brush. I'm going to grab one from the drawer. One second. Okay, now using a detail brush, you pick up a bit of the non-white fixing gel. So you can see how it's a little bit, oh my goodness. So it's a little bit on the thicker side. Okay. Also because it's cold in here. But I'm going to grab a bit of that. And you're basically going to draw around the shells. Okay. And it doesn't have to be a clean line. It could be irregular. Okay. The only thing that I would pay attention to is don't... Um, don't draw too much on top of the shells because you want the shell to show through. So you're basically gonna, basically gonna use this non-wipe fixing gel and just draw around the shells that you just applied. Okay. Just like that. Okay, so once you do that, you're gonna cure this. And the next thing you need is chrome. So because this is a, this is a non-wipe fixing gel and you can apply chrome on top, you can pick any chrome, any chrome pens you want. This is just different brands that I got, but you can, they have the similar stuff on Zilla Butte as well. Okay, I'm gonna use, let's do a rose gold color. Why not, I feel fancy. So the, the chrome pens are basically a, a brush with like a sponge at the tip and chrome inside. Okay, so you can just do, 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 do. Yeah, so this is like, um, this is what you use for like detail chrome, like for specific, like a line or something. So like even for like these lines over here, uh, for these lines right here and these, the same thing, I just apply, I just apply the fixing gel literally as where I want it and just wrap the chrome on top, yeah? So once you have that cured, you're gonna take your chrome pen, take a little bit, and it's gonna apply the chrome. And because you already applied a non-wipe top coat underneath, it's not gonna stick to it. It will only stick to the one you just draw. Look at that. Ain't it so cool? Yeah, and of course you can take a little, eh. You can take this dust off excess if you want. But look. Look how gorgeous that is. Okay. And then once you do that, you're basically done. You're going to top coat it. Okay. Yes, the leaf gel fixing gel. Absolutely. So once you're done, you can just talk about the whole thing. Ta-da! Okay, and you're gonna cure for 30 seconds or however long your top coat needs to cure. <laughs> Thank you. So that's it for this live. I'm gonna wait for that to cure. I'm gonna show you guys the end and just wrap up um but thank you guys for tuning in do you guys have any last minute questions for me before i sign off is the leaf gel tacky when you apply the chrome or is it non-tacky it is non-tacky so it is a non-wipe fixing gel so it literally cures non-wipe and it is meant to use for applying stones so that way you don't have to like top coat around it 
but it, it does cure non-white. But because it is non-white, you can do the chrome on top. Isn't that so cool? So here we have it. So this is the final look. Oh, there's a hair in there. Oh, well. But here's the final <laughs> look. So you see how we apply the shells and then you just put the chrome around the shells. Like a kind of like a frame. Okay. Ain't that so pretty? All right. So I'm going to put this right here along with this and this. So I'm just going to talk you through about what these are. So this is basically just um, the um, mauve violetta and the maroon, maroon pheasant and um, maple camel and just ombre it. And I took the oatmeal sand, the pigmented white with the spots in it and just like brush at the edge. Okay. And this is just maroon pheasant with the gold flick on top. Look how pretty that is. Okay. So literally these are things you can do. Like both of these designs right here, I literally did them with only the colors from the collection. Okay. So it's, it's a very versatile collection, very beautiful colors for winter. It's perfect, opaque, rich syrup gels that you would absolutely need this winter. I promise you. Okay. And they are currently available right now at zillabu.com for $179. Um, do you guys have any questions for me before I hop off this live? Let me just give you guys a final look at the box. So again, this is what you will get. Let me zoom out a little bit. But this is what you will get from the collection. You get this display. Literally, this display is in the box. You can get this whole thing like this. And a bunch of other goodies. Okay? So, if you have no question, uh, thank you so much for tuning in. I hope you guys have a great morning, evening, noon, night, wherever you guys are. And that's it. Thank you. Bye! Thank you. Uh, hopefully. Okay, I will try. Yeah? Thank you guys so much. Goodbye, guys. Thank you for watching.